Hi and welcome. So let's discuss about operator precedence and associativity. Fine. So for example, if I have an expression a plus b multiplied by c, so where the plus uh, multiplication will be given more precedence that this will be calculated first and then the result of a plus b will be calculated. Or if I am writing a plus b multiplied by c, then a plus b will be calculated first and then multiplied by c. So what is the precedence? Who has more precedence? Who has less precedence? So operator precedence, it determines uh, which operator is performed first in an expression with more than one operator with different precedences. Okay. So for example, if I have 5 plus 6 multiplied by 9, so multiplication has more precedence than plus. Okay. So it will be given priority. So first this will be calculated. So 9 into 6 is nothing but 54. Then 5 will be added into it and the result will be given to us as 50. 9 okay so plus has more precedence than uh, so the multiplication has more precedence than plus so therefore this is calculated first okay now what is associativity it is used when two operators of the same precedence appear in an expression okay it can be left to right or right to left so what is the meaning of that so for example if we have 50 divided by 10 multiplied by 5 now division and multiplication have the same precedence so what to do whether to calculate this then this or whether to calculate this here and then divide so who has the more precedence so both of them has the same precedence here multiplication and division so the associativity comes into picture so here the multiplication and the division associativity is from left to right they have the same precedence and the associativity is from left to right okay so from left to right we will move whichever the first operator we have we will calculate it so 50 by 10 will be calculated which is nothing but 5 then we are keep moving to left to right and whatever the result was there of this division will be multiplied by 5 and the answer will come out as 25 okay so this is what associativity is fine so this is a table uh, to calculate the, to see what are the associativities and the precedence fine so in a single box whatever the operators are present they all have the same precedence fine and the precedence is from highest to lowest so all the brackets the dot and the arrow operator has the same precedence and uh, their associativity is from left to right then our unary operators have less precedence than these bracket operator but more precedence than any other operators so they will be calculated first okay so that is increment decrement and not operator and their associativity is from right to left fine and so on we can move forward so arithmetic operators comes that is plus division and modulus they have more precedence than plus and minus but all of these three have the same precedence and their associativity is left to right then plus and minus associativity is from left to right fine then we have shift operators then relational operators less than less than equal to greater than greater than equal to okay these are also relational operators the equality operators whether a is equal to equal to b or not whether a is not equal to b and so on okay then we have bitwise and bitwise or and bitwise or so bitwise and has more precedence than bitwise xor and bitwise or okay so and has more precedence than these two xor has more precedence than or bitwise or similarly logical and has more precedence than logical or so if we have in an equation a and and b or c so first a and and b will be calculated and then a the result will be or c fine so this is how it will work and their associativity is from left to right then we have a ternary con conditional operator then we have assignment operators plus equal to minus equal to their associativity is left right to left how so if we have a plus equal to 5 so from right the value will be inserted to a so a equals to a plus 5 will work the value will be calculated and it will be inserted to a okay so assignment operator says right to left associativity okay and then lowest operator is nothing but comma comma has the lowest precedence it works from left to right fine so this is the table you can note it down the table uh, just you do not have to actually remember most of it uh, it comes intuitively uh, and when you do more examples it becomes really clear so only right to left is nothing but the assignment operators okay and our unary operators rest or are left to right all only these two assignment and unary are right to left all are else everything is left to right fine so let's see one more example to make it uh, more clear uh, where we will see mix of these so, uh, operators fine so let the example be that int a equal to 1 in b equal to 1 okay in c equal to this is 1 in c equals to a or minus minus b fine now int d equals to a minus minus and minus minus b 
fine so what will be the answers what will be the values of a b c d at the end you can just pause the video and think about this on your own what are the answers then match it fine so a is 1 b is 1 then c is calculated so c equals to a or minus minus b fine okay so see or operator has one thing that is known as the short circuiting so if one of the operand of or is more than the second operand okay if one of the operand of or is true then it actually does not check for the second operand okay it does not if one of the operand is true it does not check so a is one and one value is considered to be true so it actually does not even check for the second operand okay so this is not even executed okay. this is true so everything is true so c value will, will become simply one okay and when we come to d it is a minus minus and n minus minus b so you know post increment works afterwards so a value was one so it will remain one and after this equation is line is over a value will become zero and then now this is pre-increment okay so and also has short circuiting so if this value was false then this value will not be considered for and both the ones should be true so minus minus b will become b will become zero okay so this value will become false so d value is zero and a value now after this line is over will become zero so what are the values a is zero b is zero because of this c is one and d is zero okay so this is the answer for this particular question fine so this is how the operator precedence and operator associate works thank you okay let's see one more example so let's say x equals to 2 and y equals to 0 let z equals to y and y or equal to 10 okay so why what is y or equal to 10 it is nothing but y or 10 fine so in this particular case what will happen so y is 0 so this value is 0 now again short circuiting will come into picture since and is here and one operator of and is false so it will not execute the second operator at all okay it will simply put z value as 0 and when z is printed okay so if you print z then 0 will be printed fine so this is uh, one more such example you can make any such examples so here if we have let's say x equals to 2 y equals to 0 a and b okay and b is nothing equals to y equals to 1 and uh, a equals to x and and y and we print a all the values x y a b so what is the answer so in this particular case uh, we have two equal to operators so their precedence is same we will go with associativity and or equal to has right to left associativity okay so first one will be assigned to y then y value is one so it will be assigned to b so both b equals to one and y equals to one okay and then when we come here equal to has more precedence than x and then y so this first uh, it will go to right to left and we will have first this expression will be value will be calculated and it will be assigned to a so what is x x is 2 and and what is y y is 1 so both are true so therefore a will become 1 now okay so the values printed of x is 2 y is 1 b is 1 and a is 1 fine so this was these were some examples of the operator associativity and operator precedence fine thank you